put that on there. And I'll just start the engine. You have to have the control on. And of course the fuel pump helps. <laughs> and uh, that's all for right now. Later we'll flip some of the others. This is the radio switch over on the console. Yeah. When they shut the locomotive down, they didn't. So these two here have to be up. This is a light switch. This is the generator field. This is dynamic. And this is the reverser. And normally this is in the off position. That's like that. Okay, these are the cylinder cocks. There are 16 of them, eight on each side. They have to be open. Okay, these are the carbon traps and these are the caps where the carbon is supposed to fall. And you can see this is just what was accumulated from yesterday's run. Okay, yesterday there wasn't any carbon there. Yesterday. You know, it has a little bit more. So I'm going to go get a can. Big, good amount of carbon. Yep. around here and look up here maybe I'll open this door so you can get it that shows the water level you can see the water level here it's about a, about an inch down from full which is fine when it starts the water level will drop down here mm. yep Okay, this is the air compressor, and down here is where we check the air compressor oil, and you can see the air compressor oil is down about a quarter of an inch. In here, and you can check it from either side, it's where the governor oil gauge is right here. And in good light, you can see it's a little bit up past uh, half. There's a line there where it's supposed to be. It's a little higher than that, I think, what I saw yesterday. Mm. And here's the dipstick for the oil. And you can see that's way up here when it's not running. When it's running, it goes down here. So the oil level is checked when the engine is idling. 
this is the number one and it's always the worst. You know, today it's full. There's quite a bit of carbon in the bottom. Now the reason the oil gets in here, as I understand it, because we run the engine so slow and they never get really hot, it doesn't burn off. is why, and, okay, what happens then is that the, the, uh, the cylinders get uh, a buildup of something like lacquer, and that buildup prevents the rings from scraping the cylinders and moving the oil back down. And that buildup allows the oil to go around the rings. The solution is that the engine needs to be run harder. And the way you do that is you put the brakes on, either get a string of cars or you get, just put the brakes on the engine and you run it, which then forces the engine to get hot and burn away. You'll be able to see the, uh, you might even see some sparks. You ready? Yep. yep. Okay. Okay. After prime for 30 seconds. Okay, this is the lay shaft. Push it in just a little bit. 